I can't imagine where they've all come from. But what are they? Moles, sweetheart. But moles are really cute. Why would they do this to our garden? They have to live somewhere, and I'm afraid they've chosen here. <laughs> Morning, all. Oh, Stan, look! Our garden's ruined! You have moles by the look of it. What can we do? Can we get rid of them? <gasps> you mustn't hurt them! Hmm. I'll have to give this some thought. It's been a while since we've had moles around here. Don't worry, Amy. I'm sure I can help. Leave it with me. Thanks, Stan. Good morning, Stan. Wasn't expecting to see you this morning. I need your help, Stumpy. That's why I'm here. Oh, fire away. What can I do for you? Well, it's not for me, actually. It's the turvies. I'm afraid moles have made themselves at home in their garden. They've made a terrible mess and poor Amy's beside herself. You know how she loves her garden. Mm. Moles, eh? <laughs> Exactly. The thing is, I've promised to try and help. Stumpy? Oh, I always pace when I'm thinking. I've got it. I remember now, my old dad's way of getting rid of moles was to blow smoke down one end of their tunnel, and then when they'd pop up for a breath of fresh air, he'd catch them. Don't worry, little red tractor. We can't do that, Stumpy. Amy doesn't want to hurt the little moles. She just wants them to move on. Oh, oh, I see. Hmm. Well, I... You're not going to pace again, are you? What was that? Are you all right, little red tractor? Oh, take no notice. She does that occasionally. I think the sails need a bit of oil. That jolt went right through me. The ground shook. <laughs> That would certainly scare the moles away. I think there are even more mole hills now. Here's Stan and Little Red Tractor. Maybe he's found a way to make the moles go away. Windmills? Why have you got so many? I have a plan. What we need to do is plant the windmills all over the garden. Why? Trust me, I think this may solve your problem with the moles. And it will make the garden look really cool. Come on, Amy. I've done one, Stan. Hey, Stan, I think these look much better than boring old flowers. They look great. But how will they get rid of the moles? As the wind blows them around, they'll vibrate through the soil. This will irritate the moles, and in no time, they'll move off completely unharmed to somewhere more peaceful. You're a genius! <laughs> oh, I wouldn't say that. Stumpy and Little Red Tractor helped. Well, I think you both saved the day. That's it, Little Red Tractor. Let those cows know we're here. Morning, Daisy. Morning, Veronica. Here we go. Right, Little Red Tractor. Next stop, Walter's Garage for one of Nicola's sandwiches. The cows aren't the only hungry ones around here. Um, uh, those... those cows. Um... Ah, yes. The Beechdale cows, they produce the milk we use for our cheese. They're not going to, you know, ch charge or anything, you know, horns and I, um... <gasps> Oh, dear, dear. Now, don't tell me you're frightened of Buttercup and Bluebell. No, 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 no. Just a bit. Nothing to worry about. No, no. no. Now, when you... When you get back to the land as I've done, you become quite at home with beasts such as these. Right. Now, how do I look here? <laughs> What on earth? <gasps> Look what they've done to my stuff! I'm so sorry. I I, I can't think how it happened. Um, Skip, um, Mr. Shutter, no, 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 come back! Daisy? Veronica, what are you doing here? Um, perhaps you'd like to take some shots of the farmhouse now. No, 
I would not. I'm leaving, Mr. Jones. And don't for a moment imagine that your picture or that of your smelly farm and its smelly animals will ever make it to the pages of High Magazine. Not after work or... But, uh... But, Skip, I, I have... We... And I, uh... I d oh, hello, Stan. Hello, children. Mr. Jones, what are Daisy and Veronica doing here? I, um, well, uh, that is, well, well, I borrowed them, Stan. We've been looking everywhere for them for ages. Well, I I'm sorry. I, I didn't think you'd mind, Stan. I wouldn't have, Mr. Jones, if you'd asked me. And if you had asked me, I don't think you'd have ended up in such a mess. Vanity, Stan, I, I saw the chance to be in High Magazine, and, well, I, I wanted to be a star. Well, if you ask me, being famous isn't all it's cracked up to be. There's far more to life than being a star. There is? No, no, he, he, uh, <clears throat> there is. You're, you're, you're right, of course, Stan. Um, should I um, help you get the cows back into their field? Don't worry. Now you've stopped feeding them, they'll happily follow my own little star. Oh, pigs! Oh, wow! Oh. 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 oh, that was close. Even for me. Oh, I'm all covered in mud. Oh, well. Now, what were Stan's pigs doing out here? Oh, and where did they go? You all right? You're all covered in mud. Pigs? Your pigs were in the middle of the road, Stan. I had to swerve to avoid them. I'm sorry, Stumpy. They escaped. Oh, <laughs> no harm done. Where were they? Well, right here. Stood in the mud. Happy as anything. They do love the mud. I was trying to see where they went. Mm. Not this way. They may have gone off towards Beach Garage. We'll try there. Cheers, Stumpy. Cheerio! Oh, no! This is going to be tricky. The water is quite deep. In fact, it's almost as deep as your trailer. Hmm. I wonder if... Yes, I've got a plan, little red tractor, but it's going to need all your strength. I hope this works. Steady does it. This may just work. Almost there, little red tractor. Whoa! Come on, lads. Come on. That's it, fellas. Now, pull, little red tractor. You can do it. That a boy. Just a little further. Brilliant. Well done, little red tractor. Got you. <laughs> the lengths you two will go to for a bit of mud. That's it. Mud. I reckon Riverside Field is too clean and grassy for them. And all this mud has given me an idea. What are they up to? <laughs> Great job, little red tractor. Looks like we've got two very happy pigs here, thanks to you. Now, I think there is still one job left to do. I think we need to give you another wash and a polish. <laughs> <laughs> 